Android is known for its vast ability of customizations, but at times, some customizations or let's say tweaks are not able to satisfy your needs. Now here is when custom mods or modules as we all say comes into play. So in today's video, let's check out the top 5 exposed modules which will definitely help you out in your day to day life. Hey what's up guys, Bushani from Adboy Expert. With that being said, let's get started. if you don't know what is exposed installer or let alone modules it is basically what Cydia is to apple that means exposed installer provides you with lot of custom modules or mods that you can install in your android as a normal apk and enjoy all the features it offers if you want to know how you can install exposed modules on your device there is a xda link which will help you out with the whole process now with that out of the way let's talk about the top five mods shall we so the first mod on my list is iFont. If you're a guy who loves to change and play around with your default system font, then iFont is for you. iFont has a huge library of fonts to choose from and applying a font is as simple as downloading it and rebooting your phone. But your phone needs to be rooted in order to change the fonts, so that's one thing to keep in mind. Next up is Swipe Back. What this enables you to do is it allows you to swipe left or right in order to go back to your home screen. I know it sounds kind of weird at first, but trust me, it will definitely save a lot of physical effort of touching the home button in order to go to your home screen. Coming up next is Chrome Pie. Now if you're a guy who browses a lot through the Chrome browser, you might know how frustrating it is to hit the new tab button or to stretch your thumb in general while browsing. Well, Chrome Pie solves this problem out. What Chrome Pie essentially does is it adds a pie-like layout to a Chrome browser, which you can access it by swiping left or right. There are many options in that pie menu like new tab, new incognito tab, recent tabs and so on. And the cherry on the top is all the pie tabs are customizable, so you can use it according to your convenience. The next mod on my list is Amplify. So this is probably if not then one of the best way to save your phone's battery. What this mod essentially does is it allows you to set wake logs for certain apps. What wake logs basically helps you to do is it lets you to set apps which should be running in the background while your phone is dozing off. The UI of this mod might seem tricky at first but trust me, it is really a great module if you have a low MAH device. Revealing the best of the last is Gravity Box. So if you're a customization holic person, then this is the one-stop shop for your customization needs. Gravity Box is a module that allows you to customize tons of things in your phone like lock screen tweaks, pie controls, display tweaks, navigation tweaks, media tweaks and a plethora of more tweaks that can take hours to describe. So if you are running on a stock ROM, then this module will definitely increase the customization capabilities of your ROM or your phone in particular. So there you have it, the top 5 exposed modules for your phone. And by the way, all these modules will work for Android 8.1 as well and not to mention Android 8 and below. With that being said, I'm our boy Expert and I'm signing out.